the recent passing of Bill 1, which makes it a crime to damage or interfere with essential infrastructure such as highways, oil and gas facilities and pipelines, Albertans came together Monday afternoon to protest the UCP's new legislation. You can be arrested if they determine that the infrastructure is pertinent. And that basically is anywhere, and that's against our democratic rights, and that's why we're here today. The Albertans actually have to read uh, the fine print of this piece of legislation, and what that fine print says is that they have defined almost every public space that you can think of as critical infrastructure for the purpose of the act. The president of Alberta Union of Provincial Employees says he's concerned about the effects the bill will have on their ability to peacefully protest. We have actually filed a legal challenge against Bill 1, but recognizing that legal challenge probably won't get sorted out for a number of years, I think these laws are going to get tested in the streets. The Kenny government says the bill does not stop Albertans from gathering peacefully and points out there have been a number of public gatherings in public spaces since the bill was passed. Critics and protesters say the definition of what is considered critical infrastructure is too broad. Bill 1 needs to be basically rescinded. It's undemocratic. It's against our rights. This government is trying to take the rights of Albertans away, and we need that to stop. According to the bill, offenders could be fined $1,000 for their first offense and ten dollars to $25,000 for future violations. From Edmonton, Bailey Nitty, City News.